Ah, chicos, and this is the 2022 um, Benidorm Spain trip vlog. Um, you would have watched this a couple of years ago if you've been subscribed to my channel long enough. Uh, this one's going to be a lot better. I'm going to do this probably over three or four episodes. I'm not going to try and cram it all in one episode. So this is episode one, and this is basically going to be travelling there and what we get up to when we get to the track. This is now Saturday. We are not on track till Monday, so you're going to see all the stuff we're going to get up to when we get to the track. Uh, and Sunday what we're doing which is most likely going to be sitting in a bar watching the MotoGP but we'll see um, and we're going to go out on a night out tonight it is now 10 past midnight our flight is at 20 past 5 at Stansted it takes us 3 hours to get there um, via picking up Gary, Reese, and Riggy and then we're meeting Chris, Sean and Matt at the hotel in Spain because they are flying from Birmingham Airport. So we're now going to get in the car, travel to Fetford, pick up the guys and go to the airport. Let's get this Spain trip on the way. Before we leave, uh, I'm going to just announce the competition winner, which you'll see going on a randomizer up there at the moment. Congratulations, Dean Quincy, uh, for winning the Saimoto mug in our little tour around the new Saimoto premises a couple of weeks ago. So if you get in contact with me on Facebook or Instagram or comment below, uh, I'll get that mug sent out to you. Um, yeah, congratulations, Dean. Bye bye, girls. Bye, boo. Bye, Cassie. Let's go. Sleep is for the week. Is that how big your suitcase is? Yeah. That's not as bad as I thought. It's okay, we'll give me a big one. I ain't got one. And then everyone? Not too bad. We're gonna it's rag. Driving. This is it's Chris driving. The yeah, they got Fiat yeah. 500. There's no way he's gonna be fit to drive. Ever. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've gone to Silkling. I was still clean. I'm still using still clean at the moment. Sport four, four. Yeah. Comes in a big cube, I bought it. That's it, yeah. It's just the same as the Ryanair ones. I reckon we're going to be back 22, aren't we? This thing's Chicos! <laughs> I'm gonna shout it out really loud when I see Riggy. Really Dawn, I'm not with you. A Celeste. Siesta. Siesta. There we go. Does he know where he's going? Parkinson's and you just stop when you hear beep, baby. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> Dude, we're in, aren't we? Yeah. Happy? Yeah, and oh, can we open the doors to get? Yeah. Right, guys, so we are in the room now. Uh, we've been traveling all day. Obviously, you saw we set off at like just midnight ish. Um, but we're here now, um, I haven't done a lot of vlogging, I was so tired when I got here, so tired, um, had lunch, just came to the room and just crashed, so I went straight to sleep, so I thought I'd give you a quick show around of the room, and I'm not going to lie, for the last seven years consistently I've been doing this trip, apart from last year obviously, because no one came, this is far and away the best room I've ever got, uh, it's like a penthouse really, I've got this random room here, which doesn't really do anything, I've got this window, here. We've got some great views here. You can even see the racetrack we go, don't go to from here. It's just behind that building there. It's a bit of a mess because I've just unpacked everything, just piled out over here. We've got a little bathroom, shower and bathroom, and all that stuff. Shut up! 
And then we come through here, a nice view from here in this like triangle window here. Uh, the racetrack's like somewhere over there. So a real nice view there. All the way out to the sea. Beds, like I said, a mess. Just had a sleep. Come through here. And look at that. Beautiful. Looking great. Peacock Island over there. Yes, yeah, so that's a little video of our room. Um, feel a bit better now. I've had a sleep. That was a bloody long trip today. Hi, car was a bit annoying as well. Uh, something I wouldn't recommend. Uh, pay the extra money and get a high car from the airport. Don't get the transport to have to go somewhere else to get a high car. It was just such um, a kafaf, even though it was cheaper. But um, the people at High Car Place were really nice actually, they were really good. Um, but yeah, it was just completely that faff. Right, so we're going out tonight on the Benidorm Square. Um, that's going to go mental probably, but uh, it'll be a good laugh. Tomorrow, probably going to be a little hungover, and then we're going to go to Paradise Bar and watch MotoGP. It's going to chuck it down all day tomorrow, it's going to pour down the rain. Um, but the weather has been getting better. Um, we were meant to have rain Monday and Tuesday, but the Monday rain is disappearing. The Tuesday rain is totally gone. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday is going to be gorgeous. So we'll get some real good time on the bike. Um, apart from that, yeah, I'll vlog as much from the night out as possible and uh, speak to you guys later. I'll now go go down, have some dinner, get myself ready to go out. See you in a bit. Outfit for the night out, guys. What do you think? Ooh. I call this the James May on steroids. Gonna run out of memory here. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're halfway there. You all that in your mouth, and I swear you've lost your spill. Oh, no. Off the shirt. <laughs> 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 You're riding it, go on!
Say hello to Mr. Gherkin. Right, so that's been Saturday, Sunday done, um, went out last night, not going to lie, got absolutely mortal, um, but it was a really good night, from what I can remember, which isn't a lot, but uh, yeah, good fun night, um, now we're going to go down, Sunday, have some lunch, we'll, or dinner, shall I say, we're all signed on, uh, go to the track tomorrow, but I think it's going to be literally unpacking the unpacking the bike from the lorry and putting it in the garage because it's meant to chuck it down and rain all day tomorrow but Tuesday looks good, Wednesday looks good, Thursday looks good, Friday looks good so look forward to finally riding the new bike but uh, I've got quite a bit of filming done so we're all good yeah speak to you later guys <sighs> right so here we go day one at the track well we're gonna say day one I don't think we're gonna be doing any riding today so we're just gonna go down to the track empty the lorry and then probably find something to do for the day because uh, it's meant to rain all day but rest of the week is going to be lovely so uh, we'll get the bike set today do some final touches that I just want to do on the bike and then we'll find something to do on this lovely wet day in Benidorm. First let's get some breakfast. Good morning Riggy. We are. We are. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. He's just standing in for pit bike Sonic. Uh, he's just um, spending some time in the lift with some old people. Just want to check in with Chris and Matt. Went out last night. We're about to go to circuit. Just want it on camera. Categorically, Chris, are you uh, are you okay this morning? Friend of spin laps. All right, cool. And, and Matt just just threw up and is now eating chips. <laughs> and scrambled egg. Zoom in on the plate. Look at that. <laughs> no fear. No fear to that.
paid him a lot to go. Go on, they painted the curbs up well. There we are, boys. Is it uphill or downhill? So we go up that. I was going to say that'd be mint if that was coming downhill. Well, it's coming down the, the other side. side. The other side is like that. Alright. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I guess what comes up must go down. So, no, bro, it's on time, isn't it? <laughs> your, your bike's already up. Yeah. It looks so slippery. <laughs> Lapping yet? I just wanted a little bit of air. No real reason. Just <laughs> <laughs> if you pay for the insurance, you've got to pay to get them to come out and get it done. Get your money's worth. I'm going to sit here for probably like five hours, aren't we? You can't actually fit this back in the boot, do you? You just have to lob it in there. <laughs> what are we talking to? 
Yeah, at least that. 300 Newton meters. <laughs> Put a stand on it. That's what you can do. And the other numbers. And you already, as well. they all nipped up, they all pulled up. As in? They have figure tight. Yeah, are they, are they seated though? That's what I mean. Yeah. You have a seat if you're not going to work. You know what aren't you? That's about 15 cents. How are you feeling, Matt? Fine. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs>